fix them and make them shine I will not be defeated Because this world is mine Hey up guys, Bravely and I here and welcome to episode number 3 of our Pokemon Fire Red Omega Nuzlocke Challenge Revisited, Revived, Re... Revenge, Re... Whatever other re word you can come up with. Uh, if you missed the last episode, uh, please go and check it out. We actually got our revenge on our rival, who uh, who took us out in our first Nuzlocke Challenge of this game. Uh, but fortunately, we, um, we managed to take him down. Not without issues, not without a loss. But we did manage to take him down. He's might be such a monster. Such a monster. But anyway, let's have a look at our team. And how we're doing. And, oh, we really need to visit the Pokemon Center. Yeah, I'll probably do that before we uh, before we continue. So, we have got Trevor, the level 16 Marsh Tomp. Um, with Tackle, Mud Shot, Mud Slap and Water Gun. We've got Nikki, the level 21 Smoochum with Confusion, Ice Punch, Pound and Thief. Sanders, level 21, Combuskin with Ember, Peck, Double Kick, and Mega Kick. Gex, level 20, Grovile with Absorb, Pursuit, Mega Punch, and Quick Attack. Polarity, level 21, Magnemite with Thundershock, Thunder Wave, Tackle, Supersonic. And we got Hula in the party as well, who we've just captured. We've just caught Hula, so. Let's, uh, let's head down, back down Nugget Bridge, go and heal. Go and deposit Hula in the box, because I kind of don't need her. Don't really need her, we got Gax. So, yeah, it was, uh, we had a we had a pretty cool episode last episode. It was so good to get our rev revenge on uh, on Luke. So good. And uh, yeah, today we're going to be heading over to Bill's house, which oh no, I want to deposit deposit Hula in box one. Oh, we also got our Cyndaquil as well, didn't we? Here the end of last episode. Hmm, it's level 15 as well, so one level and it'll evolve. That's nice. That's nice. If anything was to happen to uh, to Sanders, we could bring Fire Pit in. So we've got, we basically we've got replacements for everything in our party, except maybe Nikki. We don't have a replacement for Nikki. But um, <laughs> it's good to know. It's certainly good to know. I'd like to actually evolve Nikki soon. We've got two rare candies in the bag. And I know that um, Dre has bought, brought the... Uh, ooh, new route. We didn't get an encounter here. No, because we went down to the left before. First encounter on route 25. It's a pine cow. Ah... Oh. Well, this is worrying. This is worrying. I don't know what level Panko learns self destruct. I don't know what level Panko learns self destruct got takedown which is a strong move it's not self-destruct i've got to watch out for that recoil if i get him too loud that did a bit too much damage that so i can't use another i don't think he's got self-destruct I don't think he's got self-destruct. I say! Ooh! <laughs> Polarity! Oh, we can't lose Polarity with a water gym coming up. We can't. Back to the Pokemon Center we go. We don't have a replacement for Polarity. Repl Polarity was our replacement, wasn't it? I don't remember. I don't, yeah, we lost because we lost. Yeah, we lost Flaffy. So yeah, Polarity was our replacement. So we can't lose Polarity. Oh man. So we missed our encounter there. That's fine. I don't care. We didn't get blown up. We didn't get destroyed. 
I don't mind missing a Pineco in order to not lose a Pokemon. So let's just battle. Uh, we're going to chill on these. This episode, we're battling these trainers. Honestly, we've got. A, we've got. Like I say, we've got the gym leader coming up in Misty. I'm terrified. And um, if you guys watched me um, solo running with Charmeleon on Pokemon Blue, uh, Charmander, sorry, on Pokemon Blue, like before, before the series before this. Uh, you'll know that I skipped Misty. And I'm really tempted to do the same again. And get a little bit more experience before taking her on. I just feel like it's sensible. To just skip any of these important battles. Our rivals, um, Magby, was level 21. Which makes me think that... Misty's ace is going to be like 22. 22, 23 maybe. And it's probably going to be a Starmie. Because Brock had the same Pokemon that he had. In the normal games. But added to it. So I imagine she's still got a Star you and a Star me, But they're going to be stronger. And a higher level. And have better moves. Just my thought. So, uh, yeah, I'm thinking... I think I might skip. Plus, we can get more encounters as well. If we skip Misty. We can go and get some more encounters. We might get some uh, some cool Pokemon that can... Uh, help us out. With it. And then we'll have the entirety of the route above Vermilion. We'll have... The SS Anne. We've got the route to the east of Vermilion. So yeah, we've got we got a bunch of a bunch of places we could well, a bunch of things that we could do. This pseudo would have kind of scares me. What do you think he's got? I don't. I don't. It's a high level. It's twenty one. I guess that's a regular recurring thing now. Okay, Rock Throw, we could have... <sighs> oh, okay, we're kind of... We're going back into Trevor. Because Trevor tanks a Rock Throw. Oh my god. Oh my god, two near misses at the start of this episode. He's just mimicked my mud shot. He's mimicked my mud shot. Can you not? Rock throw is fine. It's not fine. He did a lot. Alright, get out of my face, Pseudo Woodo. Man, I wish I hadn't switched. I wish I hadn't switched. We nearly lost Gax there. We nearly lost Gax. Again, we don't want to be losing Gax. We're coming up to a water type gym leader. We need grass types. We need grass types. We need... Electric types, so those two Pokemon cannot die. They can't. It's kind of a little bit disappointing that Trevor's evolved. Because now that he's a Marsh Tomp, he doesn't resist. Um, I think that's a Nick. He doesn't resist water type moves anymore. So, but it can't be helped. We can't, we're, we're certainly not getting through it with a mud kit. Oh, I didn't switch train on that. Now, I, I was just thinking, what, what, what was wrong then? 
Yeah, I didn't switch train on the, the knocker. Trying to train Trevor up. Um, we're going to polarity for this. So yeah, did I actually say about... I know I, I started talking about the the levels being brought down on the starter Pokemon's evolutions. Pretty sure that magic level is 24. When I looked it up. I'm pretty sure it's 24. Which means as soon as Nikki reaches level 22, I've got two rare candies in my bag. I want a Jinx. Because Smoochum does so much work. But I want a Jinx. And I'm going to get a Jinx. So like, my key focus at the moment is to get Trevor up. Get Trevor up to... Um, caught up with everybody else up to level 20. And then... Polarity, Nikki and Gex. They're my next focuses. Make sure that they are uh, nicely leveled. Also, Trevor's going to be useful for the gym after, obviously. Going to be useful for Surge. I'm expecting rough times with Surge, but... Because he's not going to play friendly. He's going to have Pokemon that will... I bet he's got Grass-type moves on there. He certainly have Water-type moves on there somewhere oh, this these onyxes Brock's one used swagger all the time as well why have they just given onyx swagger doesn't save him oh, excuse me Makuita. We're going into Nikki. Trevor's holding his own a little bit now, so I'm, I'm not really uh, worried about switch training him as much. Just when he's, whenever there's a Pokemon turns up that he can take on, we'll do it. Okay. Ooh, nearly. And a Fampy. Eh, it's not going to outspeed me. I'm only worrying if it outspeeds me with rollout, but as it is, Ice Punch is just going to take it out in one shot. Woo! See you later. There it is. That's the magic level. I've, I've, well, it's my magic level. It is when I've got two rare candies in my bag anyway. Let's do this. Let's do this. I knew from the start that this is how I was, I was spending these rare candies. I've known it for a while now. Okay, Nikki's made it to level 24. Wants to learn Sweet Kiss. No. Not really bothered about Sweet Kiss. But what I am bothered about is this. Nicki Minaj evolving. Into a beautiful Jinx. Look at it. Look at it. Trying to learn Lovely Kiss. Okay, I might take Lovely Kiss. Let's check its accuracy. Has it been boosted? 75 accuracy. But, I'm not using Pound. So, the chance of putting things to sleep over Pound, we'll take it. We'll take it. Let's take a look at Nikki's stats. 
How good are they? 78 special attack. That's a monster. With Ice Punch this early on in the game? Mental. Mental. Oh. He, he didn't want to battle me. He needs glasses. He needs to upgrade his glasses. No, he hasn't got any glasses. Camper Flint sends out Spinder. Spinder's a bit scary. I go straight into Sanders and double kick it. Huh. Okay, that didn't do as much as I, as I thought. Double kick. This is fine, it shouldn't kill. I was about to say, if he got a crit there, I wouldn't have been best pleased. Of course, Psybeam's always on Spinder, I don't know why. I don't trust myself to outspeed the Wisma. I didn't outspeed the Spinder, so I'm a little bit worried about outspeeding Wisma. I'm going to ice punch it. Nikki's first state battle is a jinx. See you later, Wisma. Oh, I'm so happy that I did that. I'm so happy that I used those rare candies. Nikki's just going to blow everything away. Oh, there's something up here. Ah, oh, secret power. Okay. That's seismic toss in the original red and blue, isn't it? It's probably secret power in fire red. To be honest, I didn't play a lot of fire red in, in leaf green. I remember playing through them like, a couple of times when they first came out. Like, I played through of each of them. But, no, I didn't play them a whole lot. I was I was very much a, a big fan of ruby and sapphire. So, fire red and leaf green, when they came out, they just kind of felt like just old games so I liked ah uh, see I don't know if I'm going to outspeed this this Meowth either I'll battle it with Trevor so I liked to just go back to Ruby and Sapphire all of the time and I've I've pretty much done the same with every uh, every remake played through them the once but then not really been forced Heart, Gold, and Soul, Silver. I played through a couple of times. Um, Omega, Ruby, and Alpha, Sapphire. I think I played through once each. In fact, I know I played through them once each because I did my normal playthrough of it and then I did it um, on the other one. I did a grass type playthrough. For some strange reason, I just did a grass mono playthrough. Right, okay, Trevor's uh, actually caught up now. I've healed up Trevor, but he's caught up. So we're going to go into Polarity. Because we need to train. We need to train Polarity. Polarity's going to struggle else. Well, not going to struggle, but we're going to struggle against the, uh, the gym leader. What I might do is I might dip my nose into the gym. Might just go in and just go and have a have a chat with her junior trainers. See what they've got to say. And yeah. See what levels they're at. I just feel like they're gonna be It's gonna be it's gonna be tough. I, I just I just feel like they're gonna be tough, so I think I've I've pretty much settled myself on skipping Misty for the time being. These important battles scare the living daylights out of me, and I want to make them as easy as I possibly can. Otherwise, I will lose. I will lose Mons. So we've got a Rosalia coming in here. Which Nikki can obviously easily uh, dispose of. I wonder if we'll learn something like Psybeam soon. Perhaps. Sabim's a good move. 
Hello? This cape is a famous state spot. Misty, the gym leader, has high hopes about this place. Eh. Hiya! I'm a Pokemon! No, uh, no, I'm not! Call me Bill! I'm a true blue Pokemaniac! Hey! What's with that skeptical look? I'm not joshing you, pal! I screwed up an experiment and got combined with a Pokemon! So how about it? Help me out here! And wait until I get inside the teleporter, and when I do, go to the cell separation system on my PC! That was completely the wrong order than he actually said it, but... Let's do it! Oh, hi, Bill. Uh, that's what you look like. I was thinking it'd be funny if, like, the cell separated, separated the wrong cells and he came out with a Clefairy head. And, just, like, the rest of him. Yeah, thanks, bud. I owe you one. Uh, that's the wrong accent. Hang on. So, did you come to see my Pokemon collection? You didn't? Oh, that's a bummer. I've got to thank you. Oh, maybe, here, maybe this'll do. SS ticket. Cool. That cruise ship SS Anne in the Vermilion City. I hear <laughs> I hear there's lots of trainers on board too. They invited me to their party, but I can't stand fancy dues. Why don't you go instead of me? Go on, have a good time. He sounds like the sort of guy who frequents fancy dues all of the time, if I'm honest. Oh hello. I'm all hoity toity. But now apparently he can't stand him. So it's the long walk of shame back to Cerulean City. The long walk of shame. Let's heal up. Let, let's let's dip into the gym. Let's dip into the gym, and we'll see what's facing us. We'll see what's facing us. Have I got polarity out from? I have. But Gex is a lower level. Let's put Gex out front. Let's get, get Gex up. Try and get them equal. Okay, so what have you got? What have you got? Luis. He's got a horsey. Level 19. Okay. That kind of makes me think that... Misty's gonna be, yeah, like I say, level. Did I say 22, 23? I'm starting to think 23, 24. Shada! Oh, this will have Aurora Beam. It's too soon. Too soon after we've lost our own shoulder, but there we go. Okay, so we took them out pretty easily. <laughs> no money. Can't you keep any money in your speedos, mate? Okay, let's see what this chick's got. She's normally got the, the stronger of the Pokemon, and she normally has that Goldeen. She's normally got a Goldeen. Oh, she's got a Corsola. Uh, we're not ready for the gym leader. We are not ready for the gym leader. I think even if I wasn't thinking of skipping Misty, I'd definitely be thinking of grinding Montage right now. I'd definitely be thinking grinding Montage. And that's... I don't particularly want to do a grinding Montage, if I'm honest. Oh, couldn't we kill? All it's doing is using bubble. It's like a waste of time. Okay, so we're definitely not ready for the gym leader. So let's start with the idea of skipping the gym leader. <laughs> I feel bad. I feel bad for doing it, but... I just don't trust it. Just all of the gym leaders are going to have six Pokemon. And we had such an issue against um, our rival. So, if that if that's the case and we're skipping this gym leader for the time being, we're going to come back to her later. 
Let's, um... Yeah, let's finish this episode by going and battling this rocket. Oh, there's also a lady down there. Is that one of the, the people giving away Pokemon, perhaps? There's, she's not normally there in the games. Okay. Um... Yeah, we'll keep Gex out from. Stay out! It's not your yard! Huh? Me? I'm an innocent bystander! Don't you believe me? Just had your mate try and recruit me to your evil organization who was wearing the same uniform, so... Yeah. We need to get out of here. Uh, Sanders or Trevor? We're going to Trevor, because Trevor's got low... Uh, he's definitely going for a fire move here, isn't he? Surely? Well, all that's done is spread around my uh, experience a bit more. I don't know why he preferred having um, Sanders in here over Gax. Because he wanted to roar Gax out for the embody. But, drowsy. <laughs> uh, we've got Pursuit on Gax, haven't we? Yeah, we'll go into Gax. We got pursuit. Uh, poison gas. You're annoying. We'll try a mega punch. Doesn't do that much more. But we're disabled. So. Back to pursuit we go. Ugh. Now Gax. Get a breakthrough here. Thank you. I was about to say, I really don't want to have to um, switch you out. Really don't, because that drowsy gave us a decent amount of experience. Thank you, ma'am. Give us TM28 for dig. Pretty sure we've got enough HP. I want to concentrate on getting healed. Yeah, we've got loads of HP on me. Okay, I want to go and see whether this woman's going to give us a Pokemon. Because I kind of feel like she is. Is it a woman? Is it a man? I don't know. I don't know. I can't tell these things. Totodile! You want to give it a name to Totodile? Yes, I do. It is male, so there's only one name for it. Erwin. Obviously, that's a reference to our Pokemon Prism Nuzlocke challenge that we did. And, uh, yeah. Also a reference to Steve Irwin. Crocodile Hunter Steve Irwin. Okay, so we can get an encounter down there. Route 5. We're going to end this episode by getting another encounter. Because we, we we had issues with that panko. So we're in Route 5 here. Our first encounter in Route 5 is... Pidgey. For a second, I thought we already had a Pidgey, but I don't think we do. I don't think we do. So, a little disappointing. Oh, Erwin's gone straight into the team. It's not actually in the squad. It's not actually in the squad. We've got to... Uh, we've got Marsh Thompson. For the time being, we're going to continue with our Howen starters. But, again, it is a damn good replacement if anything was to happen to, um, 
keep on wanting to say meme because of the last playthrough. Trevor! Trevor! It is a damn good replacement if anything happened to Trevor. So, uh, this Pidgey should be caught easily now. I imagine. Boom. Alright, Pidgey was caught. Lovely. Uh, given it needs to capture Pidgey, we will. It is a female. Now, we've always called Pidgey slick. But I kind of want to call it something else. I kind of want to call it something else. Oh, we did have... Yeah. I remember. We had a Pidgeotto in prison. That we caught that was dupes. And we call it avian. So we're going to call it avian. And I'm guessing this is just the normal daycare center. Yeah. Tell you what we're going to do. Tell you what we're going to do. We're going to move Pokemon. We're going to take Irwin over here. Put him in the box. We're going to take Bubba Gump here. Put him in the daycare. Because we don't have an experience share. So this is kind of like the easiest way of, of leveling up Bubba Gump. Fine, I'll look after you, Bubba Gump, for a while. <laughs> Thanks, dude. Alright. We're going to leave this episode off here. Uh, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you have enjoyed this Pokemon, this episode of Pokemon Fire Red Omega Nuzlocke. If you were expecting the gym battle against Misty, I'm sorry, I got scared. Sorry, I got scared. But we will be probably taking Misty on... No, maybe not. Because we'll be in the SSN. But we'll take on Misty before we take on our rival in the SSN. Because otherwise we're doing them out of sequence and... The rival's going to be stronger than Misty. I don't know. We will be taking on Misty in the next couple of episodes. So don't worry about that. Please, if you don't want to miss that. And if you don't want to miss the rest of the series. Go and subscribe to the channel down below. Leave a comment. Leave a like. I appreciate everything. All of your support. And uh, all of your interaction. Thank you very much for watching guys. And I will see you next time. Stay brave, guys. How will I sit in silence? How will I be denied? I was not born to fall. I was not born to die. I will pick up the pieces.